amazing the climbing power is this thing. It's absolutely crazy. What is up the world? It is your friendly neighborhood Slipgator here, kind of sidestepping, doing stuff and things. Hanging out today in a creative world to show you something that's not really in the game yet. But the Arc devs have released this, and you can kind of cheat it in if you want to play it. So we're just kind of in a single-player world here, hanging out, doing stuff and things. And uh, yeah, right behind me, you can see what it is. It's a Doom Buggy, peeps! Unbelievably cool thing. Check it out. Epic Games Tires. I always go with Epic's Game Brand Tires. We got like a cool winch thing going on here. It's got some really nice modeling and stuff and like that done for it, even though it's really super, super new. Um, and it has a little test dummy inside. Let's see if we can get up on top. Wait, can we get up on here so you guys can see the test dummy? There's the test dummy in there. He's driving it. Now, uh, the first thing I want to tell you guys is, like I was saying, is, is that you have to cheat this in in order to get it to work. And you know what? Let me go ahead and turn. You can see I've got a lot of stuff going on in here because I've been moving around in the map and stuff like that. So we have, uh, let's take bloom quality down. And uh, let's just make sure that some other stuff and things are in here so you can see. So what you need in order to get it cheated in is you need this command. So it's cheat, give item num, or just give item, and then exclamation point, blueprint, uh, things like, you know what? It's a really, really long thing. You can see it right here on the screen. I'll include it in the description if you want to go ahead and do it. You just enter in like that, and then in your inventory, you're going to get this item here. It looks like the T-Rex skull, um, but it's the Doom Buggy Vehicle Test. Just go ahead and look wherever you want on the map and hit your button. Now the days that can't be stopped. Now the first thing I have to tell you guys is I have to apologize for how loud this is. There is absolutely no way to turn the volume down for this buggy. Um, actually, if you can see here in my options, I have all my volumes turned all the way off. I even checked voice volume as well. And um, in the game, uh, or actually in my computer, in my volumes mixer, I have arc turned down to one. So this is the absolute and quietest that this bad boy can be. <laughs> it's so loud, guys. It's so crazy loud. So um, I apologize for that. It's going to make the video a little bit wacky, but there really isn't any other way to show it off to you. So once you're inside, you can go ahead and mouse in. While you're mouse in, you can see there's a dummy there. And you can see the steering wheel and stuff and things as well. And it's a little bit louder when you're inside. When you're out here like this, you can see, you can kind of, as long as your camera's a little bit further away, it's not quite so bad. So a couple other things too you might notice. Um, when you're mousing around in this thing, the mouse wheel controls kind of how the buggy is controlled. So if you pull your mouse wheel all the way back, the wheels are going to turn with your mouse look. So if you start going like this, you'll see if I move left and right like that. Now, if I mouse look, or if I use the middle mouse wheel and click it in once, it'll then allow me to use my left and right arrow keys to steer. And it's really kind of a violent steering system right now, so it's really quite quick. You have to really be careful and tap it. But check this thing out, peeps. Climbing power. Let me tell you what, man. This thing has got some major, amazing climbing power. I'm up on top of the volcano now, and we're going to see how high we can make it here. This thing's absolutely crazy powerful. Look at it go, man. And we're back at the top of the mountain, man. Did you see how amazing the climbing power is this thing? It's absolutely crazy. Like I was saying, super loud. Let's take it down here and see what we can do. So, all right, here we are, guys. I'm trying not to talk at the same time that this thing is on so I can kind of change the volume for you. Um, but here, I got to do a couple things while I'm in it. So it does have brake lights, working brake lights, and it has a horn. Left mouse button. Right mouse button doesn't seem to do anything on it. And then if you go ahead and hold your E button in here, you can drive, you can flip, you can unclaim the buggy, you can change its name to Super Buggy. Wait, no, we got to click inside here. Super Buggy. And uh, you can also access this inver internal inventory, and the internal inventory has 300 weight. So you see you can put one piece of stone in there, it's 0.5 weight out of 300. So you can carry stuff and things around in it. It's really like, I think for ARC, maybe the model is a little too advanced right now. Like, it looks so amazingly advanced. But it's so crazy to think about 
you know, this is kind of the future of what could happen in ARC. Right now, there are some mods out for it, but there's going to be a lot of mods coming. And I think it's going to be really, really cool to see all the different amazing stuff that people come up with. So, um, yeah, I think that's going to be it, guys, for today. If you want to see more stuff like this, make sure you show your support. Smash the like button and let me know that you like it. But, uh, yeah, really quick video. I'm going to jump this volcano. May the stuff that takes me with you, babe.